All right, welcome back to uh, Austin Ranch, CowboysCorral.com, the legend show. And this is a special segment we have. We haven't done this all season, but we have a special guest in the house today, and we want to pay a special tribute to that special guest by presenting him with the Humanitarian Award for the things he's done to help his best friend, Ron Spring, sacrificing his uh, self, giving his kidney, uh, stepping up and doing not only talking the talk, but walking the walk in an effort to help his uh, best friend, Ron Springs. And because of that, we're joined on stage by uh, members of the uh, NFL Dallas chapter of the Alumni Association, right? Raise your hand, all represented. We got Joe Drysdale from Atlas uh, Athletic Performance Center. Byron Williams from BW Sports Football Mini Camps. Byron played with the, uh, give him a boo, the New York Giants. Thank you. Thank you. He went to UTA. Robert Newhouse is back there. See him? Give him a hand. And uh, this is a special tribute we're going to do to Everson Walls. Everson, I know you're a little surprised by this, and maybe that's why you're turning red a little bit. <laughs> but uh, we wanted to do this because of the sacrifice you made to help a good friend. But not only that, the things you did way before this became public and uh, people's knowledge, the things you have been to Ron and his family uh, through a, a number of years as he was going through this ordeal. And then after, you know, being supportive to the family uh, as Ron continues to go through this. And we all pray for Ron, and this is the holiday season, so we need to get on our knees and continue to pray for Ron. But Everson does it, as I said, he didn't only talk to talk, he, he uh, walked the walk by stepping up and, and uh, offering his kidney to his best friend. And we want to present him. And Byron Williams is going to do that, present Everson. And Byron, you can read what it says and uh, present that to Everson. <laughs> uh, on behalf of the NFL Player Association, AFLO, uh, Environment Athletes, and everyone here, uh, this is uh, in special recognition to your unparalleled commitment and unselfishness, de dedication to your teammate and friend through honoring you as a true leader in our community. I'm presented to you on the 14th day of December, 2008. You can keep the box. You know, you might not recognize uh, some of the other guys up here. Of course, I have to introduce the uh, number one lady in my life, if I have time, my daughter, Charis, my wife. All right, all right. My wife would be upset, but she knows this is my daughter. I don't know if you guys, some of you longtime fans might remember, uh, my daughter was born uh, two and a half months premature, and we didn't think she was going to make it, but she made it, obviously. She's here right here next to me right now. <laughs> And, uh, you know, she's got a lot of talent. She can sing, and we went, we tried out, I'm not going to make you sing. She, <laughs> she tried out for American Idol, uh, what, last year at Texas Stadium, and I went out there with her. It was the, the worst experience of my life. It was great for her because it was so hot out there. And I'll say that, I'll segue that to the fact that we've got uh, Felipe Sparks here. And if that, that last name sounds familiar, yeah. his daughter was the winner of American Idol, Jordan Sparks. So, that's Felipe right there. <laughs> also, a uh, former teammate of mine uh, during the uh, dark years of the Cowboys, <laughs> 1989, 88, David Howard, who we, we stole from the Minnesota Vikings, came over and played linebacker for us for a while. <laughs> Got a, a female football player here. She, I know you didn't think that she was just looking gorgeous like that. You look, those, look at those muscles she's got. I don't know your last name, Masari Jan, but Jan Welter with the Dallas Diamonds. She's a, she's a teammate. She's a teammate of uh, Q. Q's running around here. Drew orders her around all the time, so she's here as well. So these are just a few of the people that are here that are 
supporting me, and I, I really thank her for coming. I wasn't expecting this, but at the same time, this is something that I hope all of you, uh, you know, strive to do in your lives, and that's at least, you know, I'm not asking anybody to start giving up body parts for any of your friends or anything of that nature. But what, what we'd like to do is just try and promote good health, uh, uh, you know, good friendship. And that starts from, from uh, the, the time that your children, you know, childhood obesity is uh, also a goal of the foundation that I spoke of, the Ron Springs and Everson Walls Gift for Life Foundation, because childhood obesity directly leads to onset di diabetes and kidney disease. So, you know, just, to, just that among other things, everyone just trying to live a good life, do good things, not just for yourself, but unselfishly for uh, the people and loved ones around you. Thank you very much. Amen, amen. Give it up for Everson Walls. The first annual humanitarian award from CowboysCorral.com. Thank you all for being part of this uh, service and ceremony. Uh, thank you all for being with us today out there in the audience, and uh, we'll be hanging around. See you soon right here on CowboysCorral.com. Thank you. <laughs>